Hey, Ganesh here. Uh, today we have the Acer Chalmate and the P249 series. What we get see today is we see upgrade options for the RAM, uh, the NVMe, and the 2.5 storage. And this model is the 7 Gen. It uh, comes in variant of i3 or either i5 or i7. I'll we'll see some specs of this laptop. And this, and this particular laptop is an i3. And we have the side configuration up. We have the ports of this lap uh, two USB 3 ports and one HDMI, one LAN, and one VGA out and power adapter. And this way, you could say, and one USB 2 port, one connection lock, and this is a dummy DVD drive. You can add fit up our own drives if you go to buy it at the market. And this one is a uh, 14 inch uh, SC display. But I did even come up with a full HD and some other variants and this has a standard keyboard and non backlight oh, all right hey good try to see what are the upgrade options for this laptop so uh, this specific laptop has in a back uh, slot we could easily remove up to make a way for and upgrade so it has four screws one two uh, on three and four, we gotta try to remove up the M4 some uprights. So when the first of the screws goes out. All right, the second of the screws goes up now. Uh, and third of the screws goes up. And we try to remove the back plate on the HC as uh, a slot for a 2.5 mechanical hard disk. And can either try to put up a 2.5 mechanical variant of the hard disk and up to 2 terabyte on either uh, some of the versions of SSD and variant of, according to your names, 128, 256, 512, uh, either 1 terabyte or 2 terabyte. Uh, if you're making this 2.5 as in your primary SSD, uh, there's a slot for the NVMe that could even take uh, M.2 in NVMe version or in M.2. Um, this is the NVMe and NVMe and M.2 NVMe is the Western Digital Black SN730. Uh, this is the NVMe version of the M.2 and this is the M.2 in startup base SSD. I could either put either of the variant according to your needs and according to your size you could fit it up to maybe two terabytes in size oh you could try to put up this m.2 now oh. we have the screws to remove the screws we're making a way for put the, the miami drive here rubber And we have two RAM slots, you could make an way to upgrade up to 32 gigs. Either you could put it in 8 or 16 or 32 gigs. Or 4 into 2, 8 gigs. 8 into 2, 16 gigs. Or 16 into 2, 32 gigs. That's the SSD that's close into the slot. But you could make way for the always install to be in the SSD for faster always installation and load and boot up and shut down. And you could use this 2.4 as a mechanical hard disk for more storage. Or you could either be both of them as in an SSD. And you have to put the screws, you put lock it up the SSD. That's it. The lock in an SSD here. If you go to RAMs, you uh, have one for eight gig, or you could even put up another eight gig to make it as sixteen gigs. So we have one Samsung and this one Kingston. You could either fit it up in either boat. So press it and make it a lock, and that's it. The grid is ready. And close the lid back. Put up the screws on the back. Awesome. Thanks for watching.